Hi students, teachers and dear parents. How are you today? I hope you all are watching my videos and getting much benefit from it. We Talks Media Communications have started a series of video tutorials especially in mathematics. This series of video tutorials have been designed for those students who are lagging behind in mathematics, whose basic concepts in mathematics are not much clear, and for those students who cannot afford expensive private coaching classes. I request all of you, so do not limit the benefits up to yourself. Just share the videos to those needy students and to those teachers who really want to learn mathematics for teaching learners in a very child friendly way this video tutorials will really help you hi students today in this video we are going to just play with these shapes this is a square this is another square a square is a figure which is having four equal sides so if suppose this is this side is uh, 10 cm this is also 10 cm this is 10 cm and this is also 10 cm now you can see i have made a dotted line on both squares so if we uh, fold from the dotted line you will see this part this part this part is exactly half of this this the square now this is one way of making half of the square now let's move on to this figure in this figure the same square is there but the dotted line is drawn in this direction now just fold on the dotted line you will see this figure will appear now this is exactly half of this figure now here you will see a circle and this is a triangle we have two equal parts of square we also have two equal parts of a circle and a triangle one part out of these two equal parts is called half and is represented as 1 by 2 now this is half of the circle now in this way if you fold it from the dotted line you will get exactly half of the circle now let's move on to the triangle if we just fold on the dotted line you will see exactly the half of the triangle now let's now, move on here a square can be halved in different ways now you can see this is first way we can uh, half the square and this is another way we can half the square similar half of a square is kept in the pocket overlap the appropriate half and experience half plus half is equal to one now let's do that yeah let's 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 now keep the half overlap the appropriate half here we are this is one half and this is another half I'm putting it here uh, in this way so this half plus this half is now becoming one now similarly overlap the appropriate half here is it no now just do it like this yeah here here I am overlapping the appropriate half now here how how yes here so in this way this is one half this is another half we are adding both the half now you will see a, a, a square is done so this is half plus half is equal to one these figures are also half check it with the appropriate paper pieces in the pocket now you see this is a circle and this circle has been divided into two equal parts by these lines and this is a square and this square has been divided into two equal parts with the help of this line okay now let's overlap yeah here let's take out all the shapes now here i am putting or overlapping the shape here this is first half and this is the second half so in this way you will get one circle you will get one circle now yeah here so half plus half is equal to one we have proved it now let's overlap this uh, figure yeah this is one this is now you can see this is half this is another half and we are adding it to make one square okay yeah very good now let's move Three on to worksheet number five now a square is divided into two equal half now you can see 
this square has been divided into two equal halves now this is one half and this is another half and together this is one square the two halves are again half that means a smaller square is one part out of four now you can see this is half this is half and this half can be half so in this way you will get now this is half now if you half the half again you will get this shape and this is one part of the four same pieces of the square now if you open it you will see such figure so this is half of half this is again half of half this is again half of half this is again half of half now here this portion this smaller square is one part out of the four okay and it is represented as 1 by 4 this is represented as 1 by 4 and in uh, in common it is called one quarter this let's move on to another worksheet here in this worksheet here is a circle is first divided into two halves okay now this is this is whole circle and this is one half and this is another half okay so if the if the half if two halves are divided into divided further you will get this figure this is called as 1 by 4 each part is 1 by 4 two parts these two parts two parts one 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 by four second one by four this is one and two two by four okay if we open it so this is one one by four this is two one by four and this is third one by four so this is three quarter one quarter two quarter and this is three quarter now if you think of all the four quarters one quarter two quarter three quarter four quarter and all the four quarters are composed to form one okay yeah so that's it for today in the upcoming video we will deal with another interesting thing thank you very much